Good cruise data is important for pilots to be able to do flight planning, but where do we get it? Performance flight testing for crews can seem like a daunting task. You have two options. You can either fly every possible configuration of the airplane in every altitude, every airspeed, and every temperature, or you can be a little bit more precise about it. That's where the W over delta curve comes in. W is the weight of the airplane. Delta is the pressure ratio, the ratio of pressure at altitude over pressure at sea level. By flying constant W over delta curves, say 10,000, 20,000, 30,000 for a particular airplane, at different Mach numbers, we can construct this relationship with a generalized fuel flow on the y-axis and the Mach number on the x. If we interpolate between these, as we can from test data, we can construct a relationship that describes every W over delta for the airplane at every Mach number and reliably predict the fuel flow. If we take the generalizations out of these equations, we can then come up with a fuel flow that is specific to an altitude and a temperature, and we can get an airspeed, which is going to be presented to the pilot. In this way, we can take 10 to 20 hours of data and turn it into hundreds of pages of cruise performance that the pilots will need.